There is no way I was waiting for this Quack. shit for two years. Hello, welcome back guys. So this is not a regular gameplay or tips and tricks video. This is something different. I wanted to make this video earlier, but I thought let's wait for the anniversary update. Hopefully they have some bigger plans for anniversary. But after the season 10 patch notes came, I just lost my hopes. There was only few minor bug fixes in the patch notes. Do you want to know how I get any kind of gaming updates? Let me introduce the fan space. Here you can get any kind of gaming updates, you can check the live tournament updates like who's getting more kills, which team is winning, who's top fragging right now, also different news about upcoming video games and many more. I mean it's 2022 man, so why wasting time on searching for gaming updates on Google or any kind of platforms? Download the fan space right now from the link in the description and stay updated with the gaming world. Alright, if you know I created a poll few days ago asking if you're enjoying the classic zombie mode or not. And 80% of you guys said that you are enjoying a lot. I know a lot of new players who joined Codem recently and also some old players those who didn't get a chance to play this mode back then in November 2019 are enjoying a lot. And there is nothing wrong about it, but what about me? Or what about the players, those who have already played this in 2019? So in this video, I'm gonna share my opinions. So let's start the video. So after two years, they finally released the old classic fan favorite zombie mode. And not gonna lie, I was hoping something fresh, something new, but the way they killed my hopes are unspeakables. In the name of changes, they just added a few classes, a vending machine, a pack a punch machine and some UI changes. If I missed something then let me know. Also battle pass rewards are exactly the same, the good old J358 abomination. They just changed the name of it and there you go. Enjoy the new tier 50 battle pass blueprint. I mean seriously, can't you just give us a new blueprint? What's the point of changing its name? Don't take my words in the wrong ways, I mean I'm not mad about it, but for me the update is just not appreciative at all. But the good things about this mode is the new players and the old players, those who didn't play it early, they can claim all these good rewards and also they added nuclear fallout blueprints for a few weapons which is pretty good. Well we talked a lot about good and bad things, but for now let's just put a pin on that. And let's discuss how can we make it better. After two years of gap, I was hoping for a new map. Uh, I mean, it's so boring to play a mod in one single map. I know game size is already massive, but uh, at this moment, I don't even care. If they can add multiplayer maps every single season, then why not a zombie map? Even Undead Siege has two maps. Okay, if this is a storage issue, then leave it. But don't you think at least we deserve a new wonder weapon we have only one which is raygun and it's just a disappointment in the name of wonder weapon even elkar 9 which is a pistol does more damage than raygun i hope they'll buff it in future we have so many different wonder weapons in every call of duty title and i definitely think we deserve more than one after a very long time i was hoping for a new zombie camo Last time it was Aether in Undead Seas. They teased a blistering magma camo in test server but it turns out to be a tournament camo. They could have added more Parque Cola machines, new easter eggs, new zombies, etc. So that's just my opinions. So if you have any better idea then let me know. I'll see you in the next one.